Hi all of you. Let us discuss SA505 external confirmation. Before moves into the standards, I am just sharing my real life experience. Long before I was in a teaching field, a particular student who has not paid the fees for three to four months. Then I am asked the reason with the student, checked with him. He told that had some financial crisis, will need time, more time to give me the fees. Then accidentally on a fine morning, I find his father and just taken, taken the confirmations. And he told that every month he is collecting the money to give you the fees. He has not given to you. Then later comes to know that the student has rolled the money. This one external confirmation, the things gone changes. You think of a business where high sensitive, risky sports and areas will be there. They require external confirmations, high sensitive areas. What are those areas? One, sundry adapters. Two, sundry creditors. Three, bank confirmation. Fourth one, legal confirmations. These are the high risky areas. Chances of frauds are high. If you are not properly dealt it with, then it will be surely ending up with high fraud risks. We will be comes to sue later point of time in court. To safeguard that kind of things, standards require us. You are a professional person. You are the auditor of the company. This area is better. You directly go and inquire with the concerned external people, third party, and get the confirmations. Normally what we will do, it's a risky area. Area is high risky. So every sales and sundry adapters has link. Checking all sales entries and adapters entry. Every cash receipts and banks. Their ledgers we are scrutinized. Every adapters entries are scrutinized. Every credit purchase and sundry creditors have links. Their payments entries we are scrutinized. We are going to scrutinize every bank entries, bank receipts, bank payments, bank charges. Finally, we are arriving at arriving at the bank balance. Everything is okay. Everything is perfect and fine. Can we assume that the balance as appears in the books of the party client is okay? Then surely we are going to face serious problems on later point of time. Window dressing have we heard it before. Changing the balance for an example. 4 lakh adapters in our books manipulated us 40 lakhs. 1 lakh bank balance 10 lakh. It's known as window dressing. The famous Satyam cases is witnessing such window dressing. So we need the right balances. For an example, 40 lakhs card debtors in our books of account. I am going to confirm that balance high sensitive. Then upon, upon the inquiry with the summary details, I am taking their statements. What are the dates they are given us the payments? I am checking the date. There is a difference in date. It shows that the people who has collected the cash from the sum trade adapters, they are rolling for a few days. They are getting money from somebody else and part payment, part accounting, such kind of frauds can be comes to light. It's one way. Same with the payments with the sum trade creditors. Another thing, this 40 lakh ka sundry debtors may 20 lakh rupees ka bad debt. 
I comes to know through the external confirmation. But the management has not disclosed that. I need to return off this 20 lakhs. Then it will rightly reflect. If I ignore this face it and facts, what will happen? That much of amount we are not going to get from the sundry debtors. This non-laws we have to be provided in our books of accounts which will come to know only through the external confirmation process. Thus, it's, it has high significance, that fact also. So that's why I'm told, talk at that. This is a high risky sensitive areas. How these risks will be reduced? We need a written documentation. For that, I'm making a format. As per my books of account, this is my balance. Kindly confirm the same with your books of account. So most people will be responded. I am selecting the debtors. How debtors will be selected? It's based on the balances, based on the activities. I will select some debtors and creditors, maybe related parties also. So I have to take care of them. I have to take care of them. Anyway, it's a written direct confirmation. Sending them, they are giving back to us. Everything is matched, then no problem. Everything is not matched. There we will inquire the reasons. Likewise, we have discussed it before. Payment may be not accounted, may be inflated. All such frauds I am comes to light. I will directly report to the users through my audit report. Misleading information. Banks also, same things I am following. I am writing on the banks. Sometimes I will go directly to the bank, collect the balances. Systems also may be manipulated the bank balances. That is the reasons. It is so, real, so much reliable if I could collect that from third party directly from the bank. It's more reliability factors also there. High risky factors. If I'm not receiving the confirmation backs from creditors and debtors, then what is my next course of action? Further following up. Two, three, four times I will follow up. Then I will make pressure on management. Why? Because why? Because such unconfirmed areas have susceptible for fraud. Still, I am not getting that disclaimer of the opinion instead of the clean audit report I will issue. We are not obtained evidence. So this is this is high sensitive areas. Sometimes management may be involved with the fraud. So they may ask us, please don't take the confirmation. Sometimes management delay for not taking confirmation for genuine reasons also. One example I will give you to understand that concept. One sundry credit is three years back. Three years the balance remains same. Three lakh a balance. We are not yet paid. Management asking us, please don't send any confirmation to this sundry credit is. Why? Because if we send the confirmation to the creditors and we are not made the payment if they sue for the court we have to pay not only that much amount but also the interest thereon and there has certain disputes with the goods which they have been supplied to us so there is a genuine reasons why management may deny for confirmation so also so it's a sensitive risky areas the subtle cases we have witnessed window dressing of bank balances and everything got misstated misunderstood by the various users which is known as misstated they are taking decisions on this fraudulent financial statements and burning their hands later point of time share prices got down drastically all we have witnessed in the history of india so it's very much important it gains such a momentum of the Confirmation, legal confirmations, nothing. Legal confirmation. Sometime management may know that in this case they are they will surely fail. They have to give the large sum of money as compensation. They will hide us later the date near to the date or in between the date. The compensation ordered by the court they have to pay. And it's a bad reputation also getting consumer cases against the company. 
so it may be due to that prestigious issues also so we are taking the legal confirmation from the side of legal we are taking the such confirmations so this is our small or large discussions about sa505 thank you for your patience to watch this video please don't forget to download the notes in my comment box and have a wonderful day ahead